Okay. I keep all my games on this hard drive. Well, not all of them. This hard drive only holds 207 games. It's a 500 gig hard drive, so only 207 games it can hold. It plugs directly into the back of the, the Wii. Must go into the bottom USB port. It's plugged in. It's much better to have the games on that because I used to have all the games just on DVDs. Believe it or not, this is only this is less than 50 games here, and all these DVDs they can get scratched so easily. But anyway, that's I used to have it. And I have it all on a hard drive. Let's start it up the week. We start up to your basic menu. Okay. This is the Star Knight, um, call it WAD. If I didn't have this, I would have to go through this way to start up. choose this way to start out. Instead of being always doing this way, let's go back to ex exit system menu. And just use the shortcut wad up I created on the screen, which is right here. It's called Wii Flow. This is the best USB loader out there today. Let's start it up. Okay, it's loading. And here we go. This is the start night view. So you can see the games this way, or switch them around. See them this way. Great way you can just see like that. Click on the back. See the box. Right now, the back of the box is missing because I didn't load that cover correctly. Well, actually, I couldn't find the download. I just had to put it on myself. But for now, that's just fine. But if you download a game that has the complete back and front of it, you notice this. All the information is on the back of it. See different views. This is on the start night. Let's go to another let's see another theme. This star night. Let's use the Windows 7 theme. See this theme how this looks, just choose game. See how the Windows 7 icons are? Like it's Windows. Just to go into the back, see the information in the back of it. The music plays The Japanese Dragon Ball. Yeah, we have system soft mod, you can also play Japanese games also. This is only 207 games. I basically have almost 300 so far. But right now it's only 207 on this hard drive. See no background. I was only able to download the front cover, which is fine for me. Yeah. Uh, zoo hospital. Yeah, let's go. Uh, Wireland. All these games for my daughter. You could download these if you like, but. I I'm sorry, I cannot tell you where to download them, but you can find them just by Googling it. Everything's up here. All these games are, are downloaded, every single one. I have to not spend a penny to get them. So, let's 
choose a different theme. Let's see, that's a Windows 7 theme. Blue Knight, Bob. I'm not sure what Bob is, but let's see what Bob is. Oh, this is Bob. Okay. Bob doesn't do anything, just this basic theme. Just, just, just the basic. Uh, nope. Let's see. Let's see a crazy, a crazy we menu. Okay, last one. Uh, this theme sucks also. You can always download your own themes online. There's so many of them. But these are just the basic ones that come with the the Wii Flow. The rest you have to find yourself online. You can also find them on WeHacks.com. Now. What is Kits? Probably didn't download the. Ah, uh, that's the thing. I've forgotten. I have to get those themes. These are themes you can get if you find them. I don't have them installed. I need to install them tonight. Yep. Okay. I need to install them tonight. Let me go back to the basic themes that are installed with the system. Have you noticed, like, the minus means they're not installed. The dot underscore, I mean, the dot underscore, like, Bob, that's not installed. The ones that are installed, like, Windows 7 theme, Wii menu, Violet Gray, the Violet, Star Knight. My door likes Star Knight, so let me turn back to Star Knight. I need to download those other missing themes tonight. <laughs> Totally forgotten about those. See, that's where you can switch more around. And with the themes come the music that comes with the game. Just load them up. Bet you've never seen Panda Style before. That's basically it. All this is possible by soft modding. I have attached a link to the to the information right under this video, so just click it and just soft mod your system and start downloading games and you'll be all set <laughs> my daughter loves this stupid game oh this way to start a game just press play like it just shows right here just play and it starts up and that's basically it The game loads up just like it's on DVD, but it's all on a little hard drive. It saves you so much money. There's so much you can do after after soft modded. It's time to start our first and world. That's it. No kidding. Good luck in soft modding. Good night.